my lord. What a surprise to see you here. In my quarters, yes. <laughs> what brings you here? Talk. That's new from someone who just knocked on my door, my lord, but of course we can talk. Is something bothering you? I see. Come. I find it easier to talk about something serious if we walk. I highly doubt someone would question where I am heading if I am with the captain of the knights. Did you want to talk about something particular or you just enjoy my company this much, my lord? The Rosemary? Uh, <laughs> no, you just confuse me a little bit, that's all. But I'm glad it worked, I guess. But please, I am not stupid. I can see something is bothering you, my lord. So please, do tell me. I will gladly help you in any way I can. Yes, I am aware of the meeting you had with the Queen. Both, to be completely honest. No, I don't know what she was talking about, but... You don't need to tell me, my lord. I'm definitely not someone who you should be discussing this with. Hmm? It's okay, well, if you feel like it's important, then I will listen. Of course. After all, we do have this little game of ours. Might just go all the way, shall we? <laughs> well, until you tell me what this meeting of ours is about, I cannot act seriously. That's all. And you are the one who started talking about bugs and uh, rosemary. So, if there's something you want to say, my lord, just say it. No need to beat around the bush. Your hand. Uh, no, it's just cold, my lord. I can see something is bothering you. So please, tell me what it is. Why? <laughs> because until now, you always just grabbed me without even thinking. But now, you just took my hand in yours in a gentle way. And looking at your face, something is bothering you. So please, tell me what's the matter. A weird question. I do know a few things about neighboring countries having a hard time with a threat, but I cannot listen to a loads of things without drawing attention. After all, I am just a maid. But now that you mention this, I have a guess where this conversation is going. As the captain, I would imagine you have to answer if danger calls. Is this why you wanted to talk to me, my lord? Even if you don't say a word, your eyes tell me everything. But why did you come and say this to me? A healer? I don't think I follow, my lord. I mean, my mother was a midwife, so I do know a basics, but... I cannot go with you, my lord. I am not a soldier or a healer, but... I see and understand why you would want me to follow you. While I'm capable of patching up small wounds, I'm afraid I would just destruct you, my lord. And that's the last thing I want to do. I... <laughs> and I know this is selfish, but... I want you to come back in one piece and not in a carriage shield on top. So please, I understand, but we all have our places, me being here, and you on the battlefield. I understand why you want me there, and I am 100% sure that you are aware of why I want you back safely, even if it's not something that usually happens, still, 
We just want to be in each other's company, aren't we? Besides, I highly doubt Her Majesty would let one of her maid go who doesn't even know how to wield a sword. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> don't worry. No, I don't really need to keep my voice down, my lord. This is one of my favorite places in the garden. Nobody really comes here. So it's just you and me alone in the dark. My voice. <laughs> I'm sure you could make me scream, my lord. After all, you do have a weapon, and I do not. <laughs> For sure, yeah. I will use your words against you if I can. I thought this was obvious from our few encounters. <laughs> Never change. <laughs> I can assure you, I do not intend to do so. After all, that would not be fun now, would it be? This is why you are here, aren't you? Because you are enjoying the way I speak to you. So openly. So seductively. <laughs> Something you are not used to before we have met. Before you say anything, I do take what you say seriously. But if I... I feel like I will have to deal with the fact that you might not return, my lord, to the kingdom, or to me. I want you to come back to me. And I know how selfish it sounds, and it shouldn't be like this to begin with, or that I am not sure of your but still want you back here, with me, and judging by the looks on your eyes. You wish for the same. You know, my lord, I wonder. Sometimes it is was an ill fate for us to meet like this. That we both want something, or more like someone, but it is frowned upon. Even if you do return, my lord, I am still out of your grasp, and you from mine. We can play this game as long as possible, but the fact is that... <laughs> Besides, I highly doubt Her Majesty the Queen would let her maid go, you know? I am too useful. Maybe I should become lazy and then she wouldn't need me. <laughs> or become a knight. See, I told you, you to teach me, but did you listen? No? <laughs> if you only would have done it by now. <laughs> I'm just joking, my lord. Don't take it seriously. You know, my lord, I am glad you came to me tonight. <laughs> but I am. Knowing that soon you will be leaving the city to fight, this might be the last time we will meet. So... <laughs> I'd rather stay a bit silly and flirty than to take it all way too seriously and start crying, you know? <laughs> it's not worth mourning the living, is it? And you... I just want to enjoy your company as long as you are still here with me alone. You know... Tonight is a full moon. You will be able to see a lot of stars tonight. Maybe even make a wish on a falling one. Hmm? <laughs> my wish? <laughs> but if I say it wouldn't come true, my lord. Although, I haven't seen a falling star just yet, so I don't think it counts. I wish for your safe return. Yours. And your soldiers, too. And with your return to the city, let you come to me first thing. And I might just show you something, my lord. That is my wish. <laughs> There's no need to worry about words anymore. I can't tell both of us feel it the exact same way, but our social status 
I wonder how long would we play this game? I wonder which one of us would take just one step to close the distance and steal this game of ours or take a step backwards. I came this close. What will you choose, my lord? Hmm? I cannot give you much, but what I can give you is all of me in return of all of you. I will give you everything for a word, for the promise that you will come back to me. Just breathe the word or take one step. <laughs> I see. Then, I guess we are on the same page, my lord. <laughs> no, I still have to call you that. It would be weird for me to use anything else. Besides, I'm sure you don't mind that. Imagine all the scenarios, it will be interesting to just say <sighs> My lord <laughs> Going exploring before the siege, my lord hmm? Your hand <laughs> oh, I have only one opposition for your adventuring. I will not give myself to you this time, my lord. There's a simple reason for it. If you get me right now, then you will have nothing to look forward to when you return. So, I will just... Gently remove your hand, my lord, from under my dress, and I promise you, I am all yours. Exactly. When you return. <laughs> so you better stay alive and come back to me, I guess. <clears throat> Besides, you will need your strength for departing. You still have the charm I gave you, my lord. Good. Keep it with you all the time. It will bring you luck and keep you safe, my lord. I have to believe it. Just... Just promise me... Just promise you will not take it off. Good. Why? Because they just waved to me to get your attention. <laughs> yes, my lord. You better get going, and I will be close tomorrow to see you off, my lord. No. Just go. <gasps> What's this? A dagger. What for? <laughs> to keep me safe. Why? You know, why not? <laughs> This is the most unusual gift I have ever received. I'm not going to lie, my lord. Fine. I will keep it. But I will give it back once you return. Until then, be careful, my lord. And don't forget your promise. Be careful. 
Please keep him safe.